The palace is in full crisis mood. Everything is going bad for Prince William right now. Things are going really, really bad for him. My family, in an effort to stop people from talking, from asking where is Kim Hilton, the whole family will put out anything, anything to keep people from talking. And right now, I can confirm that once again, the Daily Mail has published a paparazzi photo of Prince William in a vehicle sitting right next to my family, a woman who they're saying is Kay Moulton. My family, the person who they're saying is Kay Moulton, her face cannot be seen. Her face cannot be seen. It could be William and Kate's nanny. It could be Rose Hanbury, the woman who is alleged to have had an affair with William. The thing is, we have no idea who is the woman who is sitting right next to Prince William. We don't know. We don't know. Because my family, no one is able to see this person's face. And my family today, I want to talk about hypocrisy. And the lying UK tablet press. A few days ago, TMZ published what they said was a photograph of someone who looked or appeared to be Kay Moulton in a car with her mother. And every single royal expert, every single member of the royal rota, every single tabloid, they said, we are not going to publish deeply intrusive and authorized Paparazzi photo of Kay Moulton. They said we are never going to publish deeply intrusive, unauthorized paparazzi photos of Kay Moulton. That's what every single carnival of so-called expert was saying just a few days ago. Today, they're using a Paparazzi photo of William sitting in a car with someone who my family we can't identify as Kay Moulton because we can't see her face. We cannot see the person's face. Meaning the farm, meaning Prince William, enlisted the help of the Daily Mail. One of the most powerful tablets in Britain to try and help the palace, help Prince William to get people to stop talking or asking questions about the whereabouts of King Moulton. William, we won't stop asking. We won't stop asking where is Kay Moulton. Right now, Daily Mail has written, my family, an article with a headline saying this, and I quote my family, to protect Prince William, saying this, and I quote, to protect Prince William, my family, and I quote, Kay Moulton is pictured leaving Windsor Castle in car with William as she heads for private appointment while Prince William makes his way to communal service at Westminster Abbey. My family, the only problem is this. No one, no one in this world can identify the photo used by Daily Mail as being a photo of Kate Moulton. Nobody 
can identify that photograph used as being my family, you know, a photo of Kim Hilton, as the person who is sitting next to William in a car as being Kim Hilton. No one can say that. Why? Because we can't see the face. We can't see the face. We cannot see the face. And my family, that's why I'm saying Prince William is moving from one PR fail to another PR disaster. To another PR disaster. My family, in an effort of the palace to try and silence people who are asking about the whereabouts of Kimoton. William, the palace is making things worse. The palace is making things worse. My family, that's what they were doing. You know? First, they, my family, use or post a fake photo of Kate alongside her kids. The palace gets exposed for that. And then they blame Kim Morton. And then after that, my family, and then right after that, then the palace allows Daily Mail to take a photograph of Prince William with a woman in a car. And that woman cannot be my family identified because we can't see the face. We can't see the face. But Daily Mail is saying, it's Kim Morton. My family. But then, there is no evidence that that is even Kim Morton. For all we know, the palace authorized this picture to be taken by Parazi and then given to the Daily Mail. So Daily Mail can aid the palace in lying to the world. You know what? Oh, look, Kate has been seen. Oh, look, Kate is in this car with William. A bunch of lies. A bunch of lies. No one can see Kate's so-called face. No one can see Kate's face. Nobody, and I say nobody can see Kate's face. No one, no one can see Kate's face. No one. My family, this person could be Rose Hanbury. This person could be Kate and William's nanny. William, what did you do to your wife? What? What did you do to your wife? What did you do to her? Where is Kim Moulton? Where is she? And what did William do to his wife that had made Kim Moulton disappear for months now? What did William do? My family, you know? What did Prince William do? You know, my family, people are calling out Prince William and my family, Kesno Palace. People are calling them out, my family. People are calling them out. They are saying that Kate was going to a private appointment. <laughs> Kate, who no one can see if the picture they used was even Kim Morton. Clearly, this was staged. And my family, really, from the picture, no one can say it's even Kim Morton. Nobody, no one, no one, no one should even say it is Kim Morton because you can't see the face. You cannot see the face. You can't. You just can't see the face. You cannot. You cannot see the face. And my family, just hear what people are saying, my family, about this latest PR disaster coming out, you know, from Kingston Palace, my family. Can you please hear this? And I quote. What happened to we don't print pictures unless they are approved by the palace just three days ago. That's what UK media was saying. We don't use paparazzi pictures. We don't do that. We don't do that. Just a few days ago, 
That's what they were saying. Today, they're using paparazzi photos. My family. And they don't even have a picture perfect image of Kim Hilton. You can't even see the face of the woman who was sitting next to Prince William. You can't see the face. You cannot. You cannot. It's a fact. You cannot see the face. You can't. So you can't say it's Kim Hilton. My family, we are not going to allow Daily Mail to cover for Prince William. We are not going to allow other UK tablets that are using these pictures after saying we don't use paparazzi photos. We don't do that. We don't do that. We have a red carpet rule with the royal family. <laughs> nonsense. <laughs> nonsense. My family. Nonsense. You know? Today, they are publishing a photo of William in a car with a woman. My family, you can't even identify from the photo that Daily Mail, my family, are using. You can't identify Kay Moulton in that photo. You cannot. You cannot. You cannot. It could be Rose Hanbury. It could be Kate and William's nanny, my family. It could be them. But clearly, Daily Mail have been enlisted to help Prince William out. My family. And they are doing terrible, terrible work. And people are asking for the palace, for Prince William, to allow Kate Moulton to take a photograph holding today's paper. Only then will people believe that indeed Kate has been seen. Only then will people believe that indeed Kate has been seen. My family, the fact that right now Carnival of so-called experts are saying that Kimilton was going to a private appointment in London family, the fact that they're saying that, it means this photo was approved. But the photo does not show us Kimilton. It does not show the face. But the palace approved this. And right now, Daily Mail, one of the most powerful tablets in Britain, is being used by Prince William to try and cover for him, to try and protect him from people asking questions about Kate's whereabouts and family. About Kate's whereabouts and family. You know? My family. Someone posted some comments made by Chris Ship and Emily Andrews, two carnival of so-called experts. My family just uh, last week said this. My family. And I quote. For example, Chris Ship said this, and I quote. There are pop pictures of the Princess of Wales. We are not running them out of respect for privacy while she recovers from her operation in the time scale we were given for it as far as i know no other uk broadcaster or paper has published the photos either emily andrews another carnival of so-called expert say this Last week. The fact that Crystal Palace exerted huge pressure on the tabloids not to publish the picture shows it wasn't a candid pop shot. And they didn't want it at all. My family, said Emily Andrews. Just last week. Just last week. And today, my family, they're using paparazzi photos today. Today, they're using a photo acquired paparazzi, but clearly authorized by Keston Palace. My family, you know? Clearly, from the briefings that I can see Carnival of so-called experts receiving, clearly, 
this photo was authorized because carnival of so called experts are saying that K. Milton was heading to a private appointment. But the thing is, there's only one problem, one major, major problem. My family, no one can see Kate's face. Nobody, nobody. Meaning, it could be any woman who was sitting next to Prince William. My family, in this paparazzi photo, authorized by the palace, my family, to try and keep people from asking questions about my family, Kate's whereabouts, my family, you know? And also, someone called Chris Smith said this about this, my family photo of Prince William in a car with an unknown woman. My family said this, that, and I quote, I thought the tablet said, Last week, they don't publish paparazzi photos. We are seeing deception and manipulation on a scale that is beyond comprehension. If the international media did not blow the whistle, the tabloids would have continued with the palace lies. Hashtag Photogate. My family, indeed, very true. Indeed, very true, my family. 100% my family. You know, indeed, very, very true. You know? Indeed, my family, very, very true. My family, someone else said that also, look how the palace is trying to protect Prince William. They are trying to cover up for him. Indeed, that's what they are doing. But it is not working. Someone else called Lola said that because they made a big deal over the tabloid, refusing last week car pick of Kim Milton, we know this one is palace approved. Also possible that the person who is sitting next to William could be anyone from Kate to Rose Hanbury, because you can't see the face. Indeed, my family, you cannot see the face. You cannot, my family, you cannot see the face. You know? My family, meaning the palace is indeed very much, uh, once again, trying to cover up for Prince William using more lies, using more and more manipulation. My family, and we are not going to allow the palace to keep lying to people we are not going to allow that my family we are not going to allow the palace to keep on lying and lying and lying and lying and lying so so constantly in my family to people to the public we are not going to allow the palace to keep on lying because my family clearly they are lying a lot they are lying a lot, a lot, and my family a lot, you know and my family the palace should just release a real photo of K. Morton holding today's paper and that will end all the rumors all the talk, all the questions it's a photo and a video actually, a video a video because right now we can't trust even a photo because the palace knows how to doctor those images. This is a video of Kim Milton holding today's paper. And only then, only then will these questions about where is Kim Milton end. Until then, we still ask, where is Kim Milton? My family and what did William do to her? Because he must be the reason why no one has seen Kim Milton in months. My family, you tell me your thoughts about this recent photograph of Prince William and my family. Whoever it is, 
was in the car with William. I want to my family hear your opinion on that. May God bless Harry, Megan Archie, and also Lily Bedana and Doria Wagland, and all of you members of the squad at home. It never wins. Love wins and stay tuned to our next video. Love you forever and may God bless you, my family. May God bless each and every single one of you, my family. The palace, by continuing to try and lie and manipulate the public, they are only making things worse. They are only making things worse. It's high time to tell the truth. By releasing a photograph of Kim Moulton, actually a video of Kim Moulton, only then would all these questions stop. My family. And if they don't, then my family, every single day, they'll be asked those questions. Where's Kim Moulton? And what did William do to her? My family. And William, who has never been held accountable for anything in his life, it's high time he answers for my family, you know, the pain is caused others. Kim Moulton had a Megan for once in his life. William has got to answer what the pain is caused. You tell me your thoughts about what we have just discussed and your opinion. May God bless you all. Stay tuned to our next video. Love you also forever. And may God bless each and every single one of you. Hello, members of the Zesco Family TV. First of all, I want to say thank you for all your support that you give us to our channel. We don't take it for granted that you support this channel. I want to say thank you from the bottom of our hearts for lending out your support and fighting against injustices, supporting Prince Harry and Meghan, showing them love. Love will always triumph over evil, and for that, I say thank you. Good will always prevail over bad. Thank you so much for all your support. Thank you so much for joining this community, this amazing community of Zesco Family TV. I love you so much, family, from the bottom of my heart, and I wish you all the best. May you have a great, great day. And I hope that you enjoyed this video and learned a lot, a lot of things. With that and so much more, stay tuned to our next video. Leave a comment below, like and subscribe. Love you family, always and forever. Sayonara.